let's do it. What up, YouTube? So it is April 2nd. Uh, happy belated April Fools to all of you. Did anybody get pranked? I forgot it was April Fools until like 8, 8 p.m. at night, so I didn't fool anyone, but I definitely got pranked. Uh, I'm just going to show you uh, what I'm having for breakfast. I've been having this like most days lately, so uh, I'm just going to turn the camera around here. So I have half of a grapefruit. And then I have this protein pancake. Uh, this is only two ingredients. So I blend up a quarter of a cup of oats and eight tablespoons of egg whites. So I just blend it in my big blast blender and then throw it on the frying pan and cover it. And yeah, it's super thin, but it's super good. And then I'm topping it with this. And this is um, one tablespoon of almond butter and one tablespoon of uh, coconut oil. So yeah, basically I just mix this all up and then I'm going to put it on here. Hello again. So I just got in the door from training a client. I love my clients. They often inspire me. So it's really cool. And then I had time so I went and got my nails done. So I got, um, I just do like the gel shellac polish or whatever. Um, and this color is Alpine Snow. I always want to get those like extension ones, but I every time I do, I can't type, and then I just get so annoyed and want to like rip them off. So I just stick with the short. Um, yeah, so I kind of had to switch my day around. I have a phone call in like 15 minutes, and I'm on the West Coast, and I always get it confused with like Eastern Standard Time, Atlantic Standard Time, because I talk to a lot of people in like, Ontario, and also like way east, like in New Brunswick, and Halifax and stuff so <laughs> I don't know I got my time changes all mixed up um, so I had to switch my day around so I have a phone call my first phone call soon um, I'm just gonna have my second meal I'm gonna show you what it is um, I'm just gonna show you like inside my fridge as well so that should be there. Um, so the top row is super not organized right now but um, the top row is usually just for me and I only have today's meal so I'm gonna have to cook some stuff up later but basically I have meals like two ready to go for the day so this is the one I'm having right now so we have tilapia rice I'll show it to you when I get it on a plate but um yeah I mean I do follow like if it fits your macros type thing but I find when I'm prepping I like to have a few meals just like really ready to go just because it keeps me on track and then I can kind of be flexible with um, the rest of the day. So, um, oh, it's Easter weekend this weekend, so happy Easter. Um, my parents are so cute. They sent me um, a box of stuff. So they sent me, my dad sent me this book. He's like, I thought of you. And it's Casey it. Strong as the new skinny. Haven't gotten a chance to open it yet, but <laughs> yeah, that. And then my mom sent me this like Easter cooking apron. <laughs> so I'm actually gonna cook a recipe with you guys later in this video. Um, so maybe I'll throw that on. What would you think about that? An adult prawn is what it's called. Adult prawn. Easter chick. Thanks, Mom. Um, Alright, so I will show you what that food looks like once I get it plopped on the plate. And heat it up. So this is what meal two is looking like. So we have uh, three ounces of tilapia, quarter of a cup of brown rice, measured cooked, obviously, and then 85 grams of a mix of my cucumber and Brussels sprouts. I also want to show you, I picked up a few new spices the other day. Um, so I got this one, I haven't used it yet. It's the barbecue chicken, no salt added. And then I just bought curry powder, which I've been just kind of like sprinkling over this meal. And it's super good. Like, zero sodium. So, that. And then I got this one 
just because my boyfriend was like, I've been me I've been dipping my veggies in hot sauce and mustard and it's really good. So I got him this one, the creamy dill mustard. And it's also not too bad. So it's only like 10 calories, 50 milligrams sodium. It's super good too, so. Yeah, in this brand they had a bunch of different flavors, so. Alright, this meal's about to go down. Alright, so I'm just getting ready to go to the gym. <clears throat> You're coming with me. You don't have a choice. Um, we're doing um, arms, um, chest, and plyometrics today. So it's going to be like a high-intensity workout. So my pre-workout stack right now is a scoop of... Oh. Oh. <laughs> Precision's BCAAs. So that's going to prevent muscle breakdown while I'm working out. And I'm also going to take a, the stack, which is their fat burner. It has caffeine in it. So it's going to get me going because I'm a little bit tired. But before we go, I just got a parcel. So, I'm pretty sure it's from Precision. So I'm just going to open it. First thing we have here is Precision's casein protein. So this is their vanilla. I'm super stoked to try it because I've only ever had their chocolate. Um... And I freaking love this protein powder. So good. I'm going to be cooking a recipe later on today with it. So stay tuned. Keep watching. I also got some more BCAAs because I drink these all the time during prep. I drink them before morning cardio, um, before my workout, and before bed. So boom. I got... Um, carnitine ice, and this is the watermelon. Oh, I'm so excited for this. Um, I wasn't really supplementing with carnitine for a while, but I just brought it back into my stack. Um, so this is super good to take with your fish oils. So I also got some fish oils. So these work well together. Um, and a couple more things. Multivitamins. Everyone should take multivitamins, especially if you're active. And then veggie greens, which I took a shot of in a couple videos ago every morning. This stuff just is a huge energy booster. Uh, has like six to eight servings of vegetables in it. The ingredient list is just enormous. So, yeah. I don't go a day without this. Um, Alright, so let's get going. Come with me. We're going to train. Uh, hopefully I'll be able to get you a lot of good clips. Um, let's do it.
just going to have, like, I guess you could call it a business meeting with a guy um, who runs like a clothing company. So I'm, he's bringing me samples of um, some stuff to look at. of what I want. So I really want like zip ups. I really wanted hats, but he doesn't do hats. So we'll see how it goes. And if you guys have any requests that you want for clothing, uh, let me know. All right, well, I hope you guys have a great weekend.